Okay, let's build our initial map. This will be here. I see that. Oops. Let's see. We have. We need our bases. You're going to see that all my bases are inside this uh, folder called bases. You can give it the name you want for your uh, folder. I strongly recommend you to have a folder with this name. Here we have, we're going to change the file type to CDF or DBD. All our bases are DBDs. Let's open the file. This guy. Open. And to keep adding layers, we can come to Map Layers, press the same thing as adding this, pressing this button with the right, the map, pressing Layers, or just Control L, your choice. Uh, in TransCAD, all line layers have associated to them a node layer. So we're going to activate this node layer. We're going to have it shown. And we're going to add another layer to this by pressing Add Layer. And let's add TAZ. What I'm going to do, I'm going to put TAZ on the bottom. Also, TAZ, you see that it's in this weird green. Let's change that to gray. And the layers, uh, the, the links, let's change to here to black. Right? We can choose topology or direct. Uh, in this case, direction, direction of flow makes no sense. So let's put topology because direction of flow makes no sense because all the links are bidirectional. You can put topology. Let's put none. I'm gonna explain this further uh, down the road. It's okay. Notes. If we wanna put labels already on the TAZ ID. Let's say black. And in frames, we can format this guy. Say a frame like this with a corner or square. OK. Apply. OK. Close. Here we have our initial map. Sorry. Let's go here. We can. OK. So we have our initial map. We can somehow to make everything fit nicely. Here we have our initial map. Let's save the folder called Maps. Initial map. Save. And that's it. We can co close. And if we open initial map, we have exact exactly those layers that formatting everything that we did. That's it.